Hello folks, how you doing? <laughs> Hello and welcome to Mersey Beat Gardening. Or in other words, I wanna laugh. <laughs> Sorry. A no. man a man and a woman digging up the earth in With the, the shadow of a giraffe. In the shadow. <laughs> In the shadow of John Lennon's old school. Over there. <laughs> That's what we do. We dig up the earth. Can you say arse on YouTube? Don't. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Apologies. Um, yeah, I know. It's been a while, hasn't it? It's, our, it's, it's 2023. And the last time we did a video was about three months ago. Yeah, it was Christmas. Yeah. And between New Year, on New Year, we did a little sing-song video, didn't we? We did. So, um, we've been doing a few things uh, this week, and... Um, oh, loads of stuff. Yeah, not least, what's behind us here. As you can see, uh, this thing, we've and been... That. We've actually been setting stuff alight. Which we don't really advocate burning on pots. Yeah, but we've been burning stuff But this gave us no we? option, did it, really? No, because... It's all dry. We're, we're sorting out we the back here. We haven't we haven't actually burnt green. anything on this plot for 25 years. No, that's true. Yeah. We don't normally yeah. advocate burning, but um, 25 we're burning years now, was the last time. And we're just yeah. getting rid of. We got rid of this mound here, which is the, like this. This was a big mound up here, of dry mm. matter. It was a way above that fence yeah, line. Yeah, it was way right up above. there, and we've got it down now to the basically what mm. is um, compost. Mm. So we've done that. And it's a really nice, rich, crumbly compost. And what I want it? to show you now is if you have a look in here, you see this. This is potash. Potash is very useful in the garden and it's very mi good for mixing with that stuff there. Uh, like I was saying, Phil. Sorry. Yeah. See what, what I have to I put up with here? Interrupt you then. Compost, nice, crumbly, lovely mix, full <laughs> of nutrients. <laughs> You're off on your own lunchbox, aren't you? Fully lovely mix and uh, really nice for usage for spreading around the plot. Yeah, we, we, we do a lot of spreading around this plot. Um, yeah. It's carry a, on. Yeah. I'll carry on. Um, <laughs> Also, we've got some new things this year that we're going to share with you um, as, as the things come. Hopefully, we'll make our videos a bit more regular. We've got, we've got a new drone that mm. shows drone aerial photos of the plot as it develops over the year. Mm. So, we'll be using that. I think it'd be nice to show the changing of the seasons with that, wouldn't it? Yeah. Um, mm. We're developing all this area at the back here. So we're, we're just burning all this stuff here. All these trees are going to come down. We're going to build a car park because <laughs> we've had enough of trees. Haven't trees we? are very important on plots. Yeah, but not at the back here. We need a car park. We do not. Every time you see a tree and you you want to turn it into a car park, don't you? Can we carry on with some sense? Now? No, that's not us. That's actually the council. Mm. We're doing a vlog vlog from uh, Blackpool, by the way. We still haven't forgotten about Blackpool. We're doing that vlog shortly. Anyway, um because they are a bit void of greenery in Blackpool, aren't they? Yeah. Along the front. They've got and in and around the town centre. What about the concrete flower pots? Why did they fill them in with I don't cement? Know. I don't know. What is the purpose? We're gonna do a bit of a vlog about it. Are we that. gonna talk to anyone to find out? Yeah, we'll talk to us and the viewers. Or, no, are or we gonna find viewer, out sorry. we need to find out and open up yeah, a discussion? We'll we'll try. We'll it's try our best. A debate, Phil. That's what we do. So um, I hope you enjoy this, and uh, we'll we'll get back to you shortly. <laughs> okay. Is that when you come down from the starboard? No, it's when I've come down for chopping this tree down. There. Don't be silly. See you in a minute. Bye. Okay, I'm going to put some more. Um, I'm going to make another fire now, and the important thing to do is if you're making a, a fire. On an allotment floss, is make sure that the wood is completely dry. Um, wet wood or green wood will just cause a lot of smoke, basically, and we want very much to have little smoke. 
quite simply because we're on the edge of a park here and we don't want to smoke all the dog uh, dog walkers out so only dry stuff and we're going to put this on we're going to collect it all from round the back if you look at round the back here you'll see lots of stuff dry stuff old willow canes here that need to uh, we need to get rid of so that's what we're going to do so let's do that And, of course, the best way to start a fire, like a crazy fire starter that we are, is to have one of these logs that are soaked in paraffin and help us. We've tried doing it without, but it takes ages and sometimes it just doesn't work. So, I'm going to light it here where it says light here. You just tip it on the outside. Yeah. And bung it in. A watch it doesn't go too close <coughs> to the lens, so. And then just stick that in there. There we go. Look what we have created. <laughs> That's from um, Castaway by Tom Hanks, by the way. Yeah, look at this lovely compost here. Mm, nice. Lovely. We well, done, well crumbly. Well crumbly. Mm. Fire. Shall I put some of these? These are a bit damp still, so I'll put them at the side. Yeah. Let yeah. them. Or do you want to let them dry out? Doesn't matter. <laughs> Doesn't matter. <laughs>
It's hot. Nice on a cold winter's day. Something primeval about icing fires, isn't there? I need some water, Kath. Make sure you've got some water to dampen dampen down the fire if it spreads. <laughs> You never know. But it's like this can spread. Yeah, it's a bit more smoky, that's all. Yeah.
Oh my God, that's hot. It's taken 25 years for us to stop burning stuff. Hopefully it's a clean burn. Nothing, no plastics, no anything, just good potash at the end of it. So what's the benefit of potash, Kev? It adds potassium and nitrogen to the soil. Yeah. It's good for brassicas. Yeah. Brilliant for roses. Yeah. Um, and any soil that needs to be reconditioned. Yeah. Uh, and finally balance it in. Not too much, but it needs yeah. a, a good balance. Yeah. It's generally all good, isn't it? Oh yeah, it's all good. And it's important that you keep the burning um, clean. Yes, no damp, no uh, damp material, no green healthy material. No um, plastics. Dry, no plastic because they give off parabens. No tyres. Poisonous. We don't want burning tyres. We've we had we've had seen people burning plastic before. We have. Which is crazy. We don't burn toxins. Because they had to give off poisonous parabens. Burning. In, in nature, burning is a natural process, isn't it? Yeah. Well, it cleanses the soil. It does. That's the, the, the natural process. I need it. something to cut this. Can you go and get something then? What you need is secateurs or a saw. Amazing how quick this dies down. Just keep feeding the beast. This is an old brazier that was here when we took on the plot like 30 years ago. Only, we haven't used this since 1998, I think it was the last time we used it. Just filled it full of rubbish, really. So, it's one of those old braziers that you see cocky watchmen have, you know, when they're doing up the road. In the olden days, you used to see it a lot, didn't you? Or if you're on strike. <laughs> yeah, what about the years as well? Thank you. During the miners' strike. The 1980s. You see them all huddled around the uh, the brazers, the workmen's brazers, and they put holes in it to draw the the flames up to um, to aerate the flames. The same principle that modern day barbecues work out today. Right, Phil, what about these big pills and pages? These are old, but they're not brittle. Yeah, they need to go in. Do you think? Not reused, Sam? No. They're going in. Trust me. I'm going to put them in. Keep these people here. And some of this willow. These are old brambles. Yeah,
Did you Back again? Did you enjoy that? I know we did. Did we? <laughs> yeah. If if you liked our videos or if you like our videos then give us a thumbs up. Subscribe to our channel. And click the notification bell for new new videos. That's the little bell icon. Uh, make a comment because we love reading your comments and um, if you've got any suggestions for making great com compost or what else you can do with fire perhaps <laughs> I could think of a few things there <laughs> then you can <laughs> you can email us point us in the right direction yeah they can't email us message no, they can't us, message us. <laughs> and um, yeah um, yeah, and thank you for watching. Thank you for getting through it all. <laughs> it's hard, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, it's um, even more difficult for us. I know. It's the adverts that get me on YouTube. Mm. Is it you? Get yeah. fed up Sometimes with them adverts. It's the content as well. Oh, true. Ooh. Yeah, some of, these, some of these garden channels are terrible, aren't they? <laughs> <laughs> Not mentioning anyone. No. No. Anyway, thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video vlog. Bye-bye, everyone. Have a nice okay. day. Bye.